Darrell first calling me over the phone back in uh, 2009, inquiring about how to enroll in Borough of Manhattan Community College as a veteran. So I invited him to come in at his convenience, uh, which he did, uh, found out that he was a combat veteran and that he was discharged honorably. I think that Darrell is, from my perspective, he's a, a very quiet, unassuming gentleman who has a really strong and commitment to family. And I see that daily in his interactions with Isaiah. He comes to the Early Childhood Center and he absolutely loves this place. I mean, I can't get him. When it comes time for me to come pick him up, he can't get out of here. He's, you know, arguing with me that he wants to keep staying here and playing with his friends. And uh, so th this place is a great uh, establishment, a great resource for the school to have, as well as it, uh, it helps me and, and my family out uh, for a place for him to stay while I'm at school. It's been a great part of his life in helping him get on, on track as far as his education, how advanced he is in learning and reading. So uh, this place is actually a, a great uh, resource to have for all students. We had a veterans club called the Organization for Student Veterans and he wanted to be a part of that. And I asked him as the faculty advisor, would he be interested in a position in the club as one of the officers? We asked him, would he mind um, presenting some other activities for the club, which he did. Well, what I do at the Veterans Center is um, any veteran who comes in um, with the issue, maybe whether it's a, a new veteran or a returning um, veteran, uh, you know, situations arise, problems may, may happen where you're having trouble getting your, your pay or you're having you know, difficulties in class. If a professor is, you know, treating them, you know, inappropriate, we'll go, we'll go to down, sit down with that uh, teacher, see if there's something, you know, we'll let them know that this, you know, he's a veteran, he's, he's here on, on a mission to get something, uh, you know, uh, done. This is my, like I said, this is my fourth semester, so I'm, uh, I have some experience in dealing with, you know, some of the, the things that happen in the school. After he ran for president, that semester, we then asked him would he mind being a student mentor. He interviewed for that and was selected. He is wearing about three hats. The student, of course, the student mentor, which he's a fantastic mentor. He's gone through the whole changes. Now an advisor, because we have another uh, president now. Uh, being able to uh, work so uh, strongly for, for the, the, the veterans here, and uh, have a purpose, you know, trying to help them, you know, reintegrate back into society. When I was a child, um, I lost my father at a young age. My, my education w was never stressed to me that, that much at all. I didn't put much interest in it. And then, um, you know, going on, going through the military, kind of um, establishing, um, you know, some morals as a, as a man, me myself growing into a, a person. But, you know, also being in the military, that kind of, um, you know, psychologically, left me a little, a little um, you know, unbalanced, but then coming here, the Veterans Resource Center, the Early Childhood, uh, uh, early childhood uh, Resource, I mean, uh, facility here, it's kind of, um, those two together have helped me uh, become a, a, a solid man. Darrell is, is, is really an impressive young man. He's very powerful in, in his uh, motivation. We have a lot of students who, I like to use the expression, life happens. But he just exudes that emotional resiliency that is going to take him really far in life. And, and that resonates with, with me. And so we're very proud of him. You know, I have a great uh, family, you know, who I, when I go home, I, you know, I see their faces. When I come pick my son up and I get to see his face, you know, see how happy he gets. And uh, that, that's where I find my, my uh, you know, my eat, my joy, and I, you know, it all, all, all the troubles that may, you know, pop up, they those uh, all go away when I see that, when I see that. BMC has helped me get back on track as far as GPA. Um, here I've succeeded very well, and now I'm getting ready to uh, go to John Jay, and hopefully I succeed just as uh, well as I did here.